One agency in Kansas City developed a 1 to 10 customer scoring system for the service department that informed dealer management how to respond to customer feedback. I have, uh, actually it's been years now, been working with a luxury car dealership uh, group in Kansas City and one of their big focus items this year was that they want to make sure that their service department uh, is part of a consistent sales cycle. So taking out the selling of the car, just focusing on service, we've actually created a program that reaches out to somebody within two days of a service appointment and asks them how that experience was. Now this particular dealer sells Mercedes cars and in 10 days Mercedes-Benz, who expects the best or nothing, is going to ask that same question. Would you recommend us to a friend or colleague or something like that? And if the question, if the answer is anything less than a 10, then it's a nothing. Right. So they are preemptively asking their customers the same question. And if they see, and it, by the way, it's almost never an eight, it's a, like a one or a 10, like you really had a good experience or not. Uh, but if they see a bad score, they now have time to reach back out and make it right with that customer. So that has worked so well that now they have rolled that into their sales department as well. And this sort of automated email program that goes out asks the one question satisfaction survey. Mm -hmm. And then based on that survey, if you answer one through seven, you get a certain track of response. Response. If you answer eight or nine, you get a, a separate track of response. You know, we really aim to be the best or nothing. What else can we do? And if they got a 10, then they get an email from the general manager that says, we're happy to have you as a customer. You know, call us for anything.